Hello everyone, can you see this? I'm going to be treating this today. This is like a Zulu blouse. Can you see? I'm going to be treating this today. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. <laughs> So lovely. So I have to move it. This is it. Very easy to do. It is Zulu bead. I call it Zulu bead from South Africa because it has so many colors. Uh, you can use it for wedding, for any outfit. You can use any bead. The bead I use is so heavy, so thick. I love it. I love it. I will use it for any outing. Coming this week, I have an and I will use it. I have a gown. Yeah, that. So, let's see the way. Let's go to the tutorial for the now. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel. This is Shani for like a kind of subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Thank you. These are some of the beads I want to I want to use. Uh, this is Kura coated bead. I think it's coated bead. Uh, we have used it some time to go, so I didn't need fit to use for this, for this project I'm going to do. So let's start. So to start with, you first fix the neck. I use a 66 for the neck. This white is 66, but I'll be doing for a small baby now. I won't use up to 66. For adults, you can use 66 or 64, depends on how long you want or how wide you want the neck to be but for our uh, for this uh, last tutorial now i'll be using let me say 40 i'll use 40 just to show you the way you are going to do it so i'm using this gold coated bead so i'm putting 40 one two three four Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So this is it. It is seventy two. I have seventy two here. And I'm using this pen to divide it. This is 18, 18, 18. Oh, so I've gone to, to do it the way I want. This is the way it will look. This one will go for this one. In my previous picture, you will see the way I've arranged it. So one after the other, I'll be taking it around like this. Let me come down. This is the way. I'm going to fix it. This is the other one. I'm having this step by step. So, I will go. Watch now. I will start adjusting it one after the other. So, I decided to use different colors here. Because as I've said earlier on, I want it to be a, to be like a South Africa bead. I want it's like I'm doing a South Africa bead, but any country, any other people can use it. I call it Zulu bead of different colors. So I'll be attaching it one after the other now. That is why I left SS uh, thread, SS fish line here. So this is the center. I'm having 18 here, 18 here. Then I will start with this one. Don't forget the 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 this one the foundation is 76 so it's for adults although later before I said I will be making it for a child but I prefer I said okay I changed my mind to do for an adult so now I'm doing it for an adult so if you are going for a child you will not be able to use a 
72 will be too much. So it depends on the measurement that you need, that you want. That is what you are going to be working with. So this is the way I will tie it. Then after I tie it, then I will cut. But for now, before, before I cut, let's see. I'm removing. From here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So, 17, 1 will, okay? 17, 17, so this is 18, 18. So, the next, the next one will go around to this place, to the second. This is the next one. So, uh, you'll be working with a lot of fish line here. You'll be working with a lot of fish line. So, after you have tacked it, then you cut. If you gently cut it, so, you can not work with a lot of thread. If you are not using fish line, you can use thread. You can use thread. Depends on whatever you want to use. Prefer to use fish line. You can use wire. Depends on what you are using in your country. But here we call it fish line. Some call it wire line. Wire line. So why you are calling it. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel. Click the notification bell so that you will get to know when. I will be uploading another video. Please do that right now. So, this is the first one. So, let me do the other side. Let me do the other side. I've done two here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So I'll be taking this one. This should be the first one. I don't want to miss the arrangement. So let me tie. So you can use any color. You can use only one color. You can use two color. Depends on your intention. Depends on what you want or what your client wants. So this is I want to attach this one. So the second one, this is the second step. This is the second step. So I will go for this one. go for this one so you have to tie you have to tie neatly It's so easy to do, but because I'm using so many colors, it takes time to arrange the colors. And once you have gotten the arrangement that you need, it's so easy. The only thing is for you to just tie. Tie and cut. That is it. So this is it. So 
So this is the last one. Yeah, this is the next one. This will go for this. It's going to look lovely. You can use any type of bead. Why I don't want to cut now is I want to see the finishing first because there might be a mistake I might decide to lose at the end. But I pray that it will not be any, any mistake because losing it is not easy. That is why I'm taking my time to do it. Once I tie that as a final tie. So, so this is how it will continue to go. So let me count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. You see there is a mistake somewhere now. There's a mistake. Let me try to fix it. So this is it. I'll be able to change the arrangement. Now, I'm starting from the center. This is 18. This is 18. So I'm using the center. Can you see? So the way I fix it. I'm comfortable with this arrangement now. So I'm going to the next stage. So I will bring up. This should be the next one. This should be the next one. They are the same length. So this one will go for this one. Then this one will come for this. This one will come here. Can you see? So let me tie neatly. It's going to come out lovely and beautiful. And this one will come to this side. So this one for this one. Come in here. Kindly subscribe to my channel. Please share my video. Share this video. Share all my videos. They are shareable. There is no sin when you share it. Even if you don't share it, that is when there is sin. Please share my video. Comment. And if there is any question you want to ask, please do. So, this one is coming here. So I have to tie. So I'm taking the next one. I have to check the length. This is the next one. This one is a little bit shorter. Let me leave this one. Okay. Let me check this one. This should be yes. This one is the next next one. And this will come for this. So I will fix this one to this place.
So I'll still need to add more to this place. So I'll be adding more to this. This is the last for the hand. So I take this one to the last side for the hand. So this is the hand. Thank you. 